operating day over here, once a week, sometimes twice a week, depends on how much milk we have extra. We need to cream separate whatever we have left. So we take out the cream that's in the milk and then the skim will go to the pigs as an extra um, slot for the pigs. Year when we had our other uh, dairy cow. Um, this cream separator is a Slavic beauty cream separator. It can do up to 100 liters an hour um, staying on full time, 26 gallons an hour. So that's a lot of cream that it can go through, or milk that it can go through. It's a 115 volts um, cream separator. So it actually comes with a European plug, but when you buy it from America or Canada, it'll come with the adapter for your this cream separator also takes out any contaminants that might be in the milk um, you can set the level of cream that you want so if you need really really thick cream um, for like a real thick butter that you or like a real easy butter to make you can adjust it with this little key that comes with it um, and it'll give you thicker cream if you want like a half and half you can turn it way down for coffee so it's it's very adjustable to to the desires that you want. So while my milk is warming up, I'll show you a little bit about the ins and outs of this machine. This is the bowl where the warmed up milk at 40 degrees Celsius will go in. Once it's in, we will turn this plug to open. The milk will come through here. I'm just going to take it off. It'll go over this little disc, which sits in loosely in here. It'll come through here, and this thing will be spinning. So right here is the little adapter that you can change um, your cream, um, what do you call that, your cream um, consistency with. So this is where your cream will come out, out of this disc, because this thing will just spin very 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 fast as we take this one off this is where the skim will come out out of these little holes as this thing is spinning the skim will come out of here and so this is what
which we adapt, did an adaption ourselves, just to prevent spilling so it goes straight into our bucket for our pigs. And on this side, we'll come up the cream. So we're going to turn on the machine. machine with the whisks and we're gonna turn it on after about two minutes it is in the whipping cream stage you can see that it's become all stiff so now we're gonna beat for a little bit longer and 